I usually try to stay away from Roblox related content on my channel, mainly because I, I don't want people to think that I'm a Roblox YouTuber because my most popular videos are Roblox videos. So I try to stay away from that. But I finally want to talk about all the degenerate content on Roblox. You've probably seen videos on it before, or if you play Roblox or go through the catalog, you've probably seen bad content on there. Nowadays, if you go on Roblox, you like you see it within the first two seconds. You get jump scared right when you open up the app. But if you don't know about all the degenerate content going on in Roblox, let me catch you up on speed and bring you down to the Shadow Realm with me into the Roblox degenerate content cesspool. If I have to see eye bleaching content, I'm gonna drag you down with me. So for those people who touch grass and take showers, Roblox is a platform where you can play user generated games. So you'll go on, other people make games, they publish it on Roblox, and uh, they can make money off of it. Barely any money off of it. That's pretty much all there is to it. That's something that Fortnite is actively trying to do. They're trying to switch their uh, Battle Royale game into more of a platform game like Roblox, so it, it'll still survive. And with the games being made by users, there's bound to be some bad apples out there that are willing to create bad content because... Why not? They don't have anything else to do. They have like cookie crumbs all over their lap, talking to their like body pillow, living in their mom's basement. They have nothing better to do, so they make weird Roblox games. Deplorable content on Roblox isn't anything new on the platform. I'm not like opening your third eye or anything. The earliest known case that I know is I was watching a video and this this was like a long time ago. I don't know if it was an admin or like an active player on it, but what he did, he imported the classic Roblox female rig and he just put two cylindrical parts on the avatar's chest. This compared to like the stuff that they're making now is like primal. So like a virus, inappropriate content constantly grew on Roblox and is still grown to this day, even more than ever now, unfortunately. And especially now with Roblox allowing user generated accessories. On Roblox, you can buy accessories that were made by admins or Roblox themselves. Since it's made by the company itself, there's not gonna be any inappropriate clothing. Any inappropriate accessories? A long time ago, Roblox made it so users can make t-shirts and uh, then they can make shirts and pants which some of them were that good, and now they're allowing users to create their own accessories, which is even worse now. There can be like an incel that can make like the most atrocious thing on Roblox and just upload it to the catalog for little kids to see. I'll show you a clip of me scrolling through the catalog. I'll be looking at it on my alt, alt account, and the only thing I bought on my alt account was a worm bundle. I mean, listen, if you saw that bundle too, you'd buy it without hesitation. And before I roll a clip, I just want you to keep in mind that 60% of Roblox's users are under 16 years old. Roblox is exploiting kids to this kind of content. I mean, that's been said a million times, but I just want to reiterate that. I'm on my alt account right now. As you can see, I got 25 Robux. I can go band for band with anybody with the amount of Robux I have. I'm practically Scrooge McDuck with how much Robux I have. So let's go to the marketplace, see what we can find. Immediately, I have Diddy. P. Diddy's head on Robux. That is crazy. That is wild. So if you don't know, P. Diddy is, uh, he did very bad things involving kids. The worm hit is like, protruding out of his forehead. He's like, he's like little Uzi with a diamond. This, this kid did nothing wrong. He didn't like commit like mass murder, arson or anything. This guy on the other hand, Drake. I don't, oh my God. <laughs> yeah, Freak Bob, Freaky. I don't know if it's like new slang. Cause like, I, I remember a while ago, Freaky meant like, if you're freaky, then you're like ugly. You're like hideous. You're like a Neanderthal. But Freaky now means like nothing good. Gyat, I'm freaky. Ain't no party like a Diddy party. And then you got anime fantasy fighter girl. This is literally like R63 and R3 combined. The body's also really contorted. Do you see how like the pixels kind of like overlap? Let's see all clothing. You have Diddy, Diddy, Beat. Pink bow, white, what? Oh my God, my Roblox character has saggy boobs. Okay, this, R6, R15 cropped woman top. You actually like have like chesticles on this. Same thing with here, bunny, 1.0 woman chest top. I don't even know what to say, this is just bad. There's also this game called Catalog Avatar Creator. It's on Roblox, it's one of the games, and you can actually try on outfits in game. And there are community submissions on Catalog Avatar Creator. And I actually went on there before, I went on the trending tab. What I saw was awful. So you go to community outfits, most popular, um, and I'm like, these will be fine. You know, like, it's, it's just like normal outfits. I can get under why this is one of the most popular outfits. But then you go to like trending and you see like really weird stuff. But like this, this is weird. 
especially when you look at the back they're handcuffed and like see this is weird because like they, they're like handcuffed in the back like i don't know i find this stuff really weird dr disrespect you have dr disrespect in here that's wild and he's got the little predator on too if you search up crop well like weird stuff up. yep okay if you search up crop you're gonna see like stuff like this what is this i'm never playing roblox again you can dress up as EDP and P Diddy. I mean, normally I find this like goofy, but I mean like this is on a website where it's mainly catered towards kids. Now onto the games, the real meat and potatoes, the cream of the crop of bad Roblox content. Roblox games have gotten worse with inappropriate games, uh, especially recently. I don't know why, but recently I've been seeing a lot more inappropriate games. There are even games where including context is really bad, like Diddy Party. There's a game on Roblox called Diddy Party. I think most of the people that play Diddy Party don't even know what Diddy did. And then there's another game called Escape Freaky Obby with hundreds of people playing the game and millions of visits. And the game is still up to this day. Even if you're already down bad, looking up a simple keyword on Roblox can give you a bunch of bottom of the barrel cesspool games. Why not just make these games on a site instead of Roblox where a bunch of kids are going to see that? Because if kids go in the catalog and see like really revealing clothing or like really inappropriate content on the catalog or on games itself, they're going to lean more into that because they're being shown more of that. This is how you get kids addicted to this is bad. So these games also have their icons set to what I assume is a screenshot of Roblox. That is so bad. That, oh, I decided to play some of these games like Freak Yabi with one of my friends because I'd rather suffer with someone instead of suffering alone. I'm also going to be playing these games on my alt account. So nobody will see me playing these games on my main account and think that I'm that I'm a freak. Also, while preparing for this video, I saw this game on the sponsor tab. It's called Obby, but you're big backed. That's on the Roblox sponsored category. How does this game have 15 players? A anyways, let's check out these games. All right, so if you go over here and you type in R64 and you go on experiences, look at all of this. R64. Look at oh, this. <laughs> this is terrible. Right. Oh my God. Oh wait, no, this is R63, not R64, it's R63. Sussy game not patched. This is all like, I feel like this, most of these are from videos. Let's see, let's see what this is about. Sussy game not patched slash marking. Welcome to totally not sus game. There's bypass stuff. Bypass V2 access, not bypass V2 exploit. Don't look inside the house. Don't look inside the house. You know what this is for? So there's a timer, and then when the timer is done, you can, you know, you can like see whatever they want to show you. What I feel like is that nothing's going to even like show because what they're doing is engagement farming. So basically, what they do is they have like this 15 minute timer so they can get premium uh, engagement and normal engagement so they can get Robux out of it. It's disgusting so. that these kind of game, games get like more players for some reason. Just look at the lobby. Look at all that people. I mean, the, the reason they... why there's so many people in here is because they're all like, they all want to see like a naked Robux character. On to the next game. You ready? Uh... Oh, hey, so can you check the car before we... St oh what? My God, what? Oh, what? What? Oh, what? What? <laughs> god, oh my where are you? god Someone call god. is this like a horror game i hope it is oh uh, okay okay you drive away two, uh, two three two three oh it works let's go oh oh, oh. what oh no what oh is this god. very oh, this sussy door game. oh no hi there so you wanted mm -hmm. you wanted to see the what all right, I'm using like a camera glitch, so I'm seeing what this person says. Okay, we'll hear you. Oh, uh, what? Very or... Oh, I just chatted Wait. with them. That's so weird. That's so weird. Like Nine-year-olds probably grab... play this game. All right, what's up? Someone grab the, the things for the shop and just paste <laughs> the, the thing. Oh, free model? The oh, yeah, that's definitely what it... Oh, oh my god. Well, okay, here you go. Oh, they just have the same exact dialogue, I think. Dude, this person actually has like... A chest. That's oh, so weird on Roblox. Oh wait, that's a player? No, that's There's... not a player. That's that's an NPC. Hi, very surprised. Oh my At god. The end? What? Wait, someone donated that. Oh wait, wait. Let's look. Oh. Top active. What? Two. Who spent two hours on this game? <laughs> Jimmy, what are you doing here? This is yeah. P Diddy. There are so many games on him. Oh look, and there's Drake. What is that? 
This is a guy who did very inappropriate things with minors. And there are a yeah, bunch of these games on it, and Roblox just allows it. And then there's Drake, too, who also did really bad things to minors. So, I mean, there's a thousand people playing this game. It has 3.9 oh, no. million views, and it's still not taken <gasps> down. Like, I mean, it's, it's not even well right. made. <laughs> Why are people playing this game? It's not even well made. It's a bunch of white liquid. What is this? Oh, no. Roblox even goes off platform with its inappropriate content, which isn't their fault. It's bound to happen with any game or industry that's big. There's bound to be inappropriate content of it. There's a Roblox avatar type called R63, where the avatars actually have chesticles. Now, with avatar body types in Roblox, there's R6, which is the first rig that came out. It has six parts. R15 came out, which has 15 parts. Now there's R63. I don't know why it's called R63. These avatars aren't actually on Roblox, thank God. Instead, they're made on Blender or on Roblox's own game engine. Uh, these avatars would then be depicted in very inappropriate scenarios and uh, have very inappropriate clothing on. YouTube videos will usually use these avatars and put them in the video. Again, in very inappropriate scenarios, the thumbnail will almost always show something really, really bad. Um, and then when you watch the video, it's not as bad as what the thumbnail leads it to be, but it, it's still bad because it, it still has the avatar in it. I mean, it's pretty much just clickbait trying to get views from horny troglodytes. I'd argue it's just as bad as gotcha heat videos. That's pretty much all I wanted to talk about just how bad Roblox has gotten with its inappropriate content with games, clothes, off-site videos, which again is bound to happen with any popular industry or game. Moral of the story, report inappropriate Roblox content. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.